Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's 30 degrees outside, but we are wearing winter clothes. Why? Well, that's because we are visiting Jungfrau Mountain today. It's also known as Top of Europe. But wait, before we start, there is a little misunderstanding I want to clear up. Even though Jungfrau is called the top of Europe, it's not actually the highest mountain in the Europe. Surprisingly, right? So why it's called the top of Europe? Well, it's because Jungfrau is the home to the highest railway station in Europe. The Jungfrau Railway Station. It's located at that incredible 3,454 meters or 11,332 feet above sea level. And it sits between two towering mountains, Jungfrau and Monch, right here in the Bernese Alps. The views are breathtaking. You can see glaciers, snow-covered peaks and stunning alpine landscape. It's an absolute must-see destination if you are in Swiss Alps. This is actually my second time visiting the top of Europe, and today we are taking a slightly different route. We are catching the train from Lauterbrunnen to Pleines Crater, and from there we will switch to another train that takes us all the way up to the Jungfrau. Last time I took the cable car from Riedelbohr to Ayu Glacier, and then hopped on the train. So, you have a couple of options when traveling up here. But one thing is certain, you can only reach Jungfrau by train. Here we are at the Lauterbrunnen station. We are all set to start our journey. And I will make sure to show you some of the beautiful scenery along the way. As we travel through this region, you will notice the sound of cowbells everywhere. It's a really charming part of the experience here. Now we are waiting to take the train from Kleineschkeda to Jungfrau. Here is our ticket. The train has arrived. Let's get on board. So there is not much sightseeing from here on, because we will be traveling to a tunnel that runs through the mountain all the way up to the Jungfrau. It's a bit of a surreal journey, but it's all part of the experience. We have made it. As you can see, we are still inside the mountain tunnel, Jungfrau Station. It's freezing here, so be prepared for that. There is a lot to do here besides seeing the view. You can visit the Sphinx Observatory, explore the ice palace, or even check out the snow fun park if you want some adventure. But today, we are here to see the iconic view from the top of Europe. So, let's head outside. Wow, just look at this. Impressive, right?
It's very slippery here, so be very careful. It's actually around 30 degrees Celsius where we started, but here it's closer to 5 or 7 degrees. Last time I was here, it was winter, and it was much colder, around minus 15 degrees Celsius. The snow was also much deeper back then. Now it's August, and toward the snow has melted a bit, there is still plenty left. Everyone is waiting to get that perfect picture with the Swiss flag. And here I am. Before we wrap up, there are also some gift shops and restaurants here at the top. Everything you might need for a little break or a souvenir. Well, that's it for today. Visiting the top of Europe is truly an unforgettable experience. Thank you for joining me today. I will see you next time. Bye.